Hello there, and welcome. How's it going? This is Mark Castillo, aka the Digital Marketing Warrior. Welcome to the Ask and Be Inspired Affiliate Marketing live stream, designed to help you get unstuck, produce results, and achieve time freedom, even if you're brand new. I've been hearing a lot about this topic, about AI doing all of your marketing efforts for you. It can streamline your business. It can help make your life a lot easier. But can you entirely depend on artificial intelligence to do all of your marketing efforts for you without you ha ever having to lift a finger? What I'm going to go ahead and do is I'll share my screen and I'm going to give you an illustration to showcase to you the truth that a lot of people are not talking about when it comes to artificial intelligence and its purpose in business. So let me go ahead and share my screen. Okay. Let's take these prompts out. Put the screen like this. And here is the blank drawing board. So over to one side, I am gonna draw artificial intelligence. Now, mind you, I'm not drawing a masterpiece, but I'm doing an illustration to cover the main point I'm gonna be talking about over here. Okay, so here is AI, and here is you. So we have AI on the left, and we have you, obviously, on the far right. So if we switch to text box right about here. We're going to cover how a I can help you in marketing. see okay so we're going to cover how ai can help you in marketing let's underline it right over here and let's start another text box right over here okay so to answer the question can, can ai entirely help you with your marketing efforts i say no but that doesn't mean it can't help you at all what ai can do for you is help give you actually do this ai can help you generate ideas for content Now, this is a great thing that AI can do for you. So let's say on one week, you're stuck on what to talk about for your affiliate marketing business. What you can do is you can log into ChatGPT. You can create a free account. And then you can just start asking ChatGPT, what are some topics I can talk about for affiliate marketing? And then when you ask it that prompt, it can give you a whole slew of ideas for what you can talk about as far as your content's concerned. Now, there's no more excuses as to what do I talk about for my content? 
What do I talk about to my audience? If you're out of ideas, you can go into the back office of your AI generator and ask it for some ideas. Now, another thing that AI can help you do is get an idea for how your writing should look like. So actually put it right here. So AI can help get uh, help you get an idea for how your writing should look like. For instance, let's say you're doing email marketing and you want to make sure that you structure your emails so that you're not looking like an amateur. Well, typing it in the AI generator back office, you can get an idea for how your email should look like when you're sending it out to your list. It can give you that an idea. Now, I'll come back to this point, but you want to be mindful of using prompts as is, and I'll go into later why that is. But for now, AI can help you get an idea for how your writing should look like. Now, another thing that I do enjoy about using artificial intelligence for my marketing efforts is it can help you do some basic editing. That is, add emojis to your post. Do spelling and grammar checks. And it can also help you do an exact word count. So for instance, if you need to do an email, say you need to do it at 300 words, you can just type it in the AI generator and tell it that you want to create an email that's no more than a 300 word count. And what it can do is it can create that email for you with that exact word count. So AI can help you do some basic editing and I use it for that because sometimes I sometimes I don't have time to do like a full spelling and grammar check. There are times where I just want to get it done. And so that's what AI can do for you and especially for emojis. So let's say you want to add emojis to a post, but you're not quite sure what emojis you should use for your post. That's where AI can come in handy. It can help add emojis to your social media post at certain points so they look natural and they blend in with the post. So you're not just picking random emojis, especially if you don't know which ones to pick. So AI can help you do some basic editing with your marketing efforts. So, so far we have, it can generate ideas for content. It can give you an idea for how your writing should look like, and it can help you do some basic editing if you needed to. Let's say also, I'm gonna add this as another feature that AI can help you do in marketing. It can, well, I don't want to say ideas for content, but you can ask it questions, advice on certain topics relating to marketing. Okay, so. You can actually ask AI 
questions, advice on certain topics relating to marketing. But I'm going to caution you here. While AI generators can help give you a plethora of ideas, it should not replace marketing skills that you need to have developed so you can become profitable for your business with your business. I'm going to repeat that again. Just because AI generators can do all these different things, a plethora of possibilities, it does not mean that it should entirely replace those marketing skills you need to have developed in order to become profitable with your business. So you can ask questions, advice on certain topics relating to marketing, and you can use that as ideas for content. You can use it as a simple guideline on what to do. But as I said before, it should not replace that skill set that you need to have developed. So I'd still recommend, highly recommend you invest into courses that are going to teach you marketing skills because the AI generator can only do so much. Now, we're going to go into why AI will never replace your marketing completely. Okay. Let's underline this. Shrink this down. Okay. So now we're going to talk in about why AI will never replace your marketing completely. So to go back to the question, can AI do all your marketing efforts for you? The simple answer is no. And it's never going to replace your marketing completely. And this is why. And I just talked about this earlier. And let me do this over here. It's already done. Okay. So AI will never replace your marketing completely because you still need to develop your marketing skill sets to become profitable with your business. AI should not be an excuse for why you can't develop your marketing skill sets. For example, learning how to do copywriting. If you let AI do all the writing for you and you give no input on it, chances are it's going to look obvious. It's not going to look natural and it's not going to sound like it's coming from you. I've done it so many times where I've had the AI generator, particularly chat GPT, write some emails for me with without me having to write them myself there was a time i was testing that out and what i found is although the writing can be good at first i can't really exactly get it to sound like it's coming from me and it can't honestly replace that skill set because with email marketing there's a certain way you got to write your emails in a way that it can build rapport. It can build a relationship with your list. 
it cannot write the same way that you talk. It just quite isn't there yet. And it, there may come a point, it might be already, but there might come a point where it can exactly write just as good or even better than you can. But I would not entirely depend on it because it, it's not, it doesn't come natural. And if you rely on th ch chat AI generators like ChatGPT to do all the writing for you, chances are when your list reads those emails, they're going to seem like they're not really talking to you, but more like talking to a robot. Which leads me into the next thing. It cannot be you. AI can never replace you. Now, there's a lot of people clamoring for, oh, I cannot wait for AI to do all the marketing for me so I can just kick back, relax, and I never have to lift a finger. The truth of the matter is, it cannot be entirely you. It cannot entirely do all the marketing for you. Because at the end of the day, you are you. You are unique. You have a certain way that you talk. You have a certain way that you think. And no matter how fancy or how advanced AI becomes, it just simply cannot exactly 100% copy you entirely so you got to make sure that you don't rely on it entirely for your marketing efforts because if you do chances are it's not going to sound like it's coming from you now you can give it prompts to where you can make it sound like it's coming from you but no matter what you do it's just not going to quite do it 100 percent so AI cannot be you, and you still need to put in work. Don't get me wrong. I'm grateful for the technology that we have, how it's opened up a lot of different opportunities over the years. But one thing I am not an advocate for is how technology is giving us an excuse to be lazy. In particular with affiliate marketing, encouraging us to become lazy with our marketing efforts. We just simply think that we could just go into our AI generator and go, write this blog post for me or write this email up for me. And then whatever is spitballed out, we just glance over it and just say, okay, it looks good. And then we just copy and paste it to send to our list for emails. And then we just think nothing of it after that. But you got to keep in mind, you still got to put in the work. Now for emails, if you're using, say, chat GPT to write emails for you, you still got to take the time to learn those to learn how to write those emails. You cannot entirely depend on chat GPT to do all the writing for you. Now, I'm a freelance copywriter myself. I write emails for people. I write my own emails. And comparably to chat GPT versus me as a freelance copywriter, it just can't match that level in a way that you can tell that Work is being put into that email. Love and care is being put into that email. AI is never going to be able to entirely replicate it. So don't make AI the excuse to not put in the work because you still got to put in the work. So you still need to develop your marketing skill sets to become profitable with your business. AI can never be you. And you still need to put in the work for your business. Don't get sold into this illusion that AI is going to replace 
your work, you doing the work entirely. There's still some work you got to put into this business. Otherwise, if you don't, then you're still going to be struggling. Now, I've seen people use the AI generator tools, and I've watched what they do with them. Something I can tell you up front is while it seems neat that it can do all these features, a lot of people that they're using it for the first time and they don't know what they're doing, chances are it's not going to benefit them over the long term. Like I've mentioned already, they still need to learn the skill sets because the skills are what's going to help them not only pay their bills, but become profitable in their business. Now, I'm sure there's a way that you can use AI as part of your marketing strategy, but I caution you, it's not something to be entirely dependent on. Think of AI like your sidekick, for instance. Think of it like uh, Batman and Robin. So whenever you need help, you have a Robin to depend on, or in this case, AI but not to entirely depend on. If you need some ideas or suggestions, you can go type it in the AI generator to get some ideas. Now, sometimes you can use those ideas as is. Sometimes you'll need to personalize it to make it sound like it's coming from you. So while AI is a neat tool that you can use for your marketing strategy. Don't entirely depend on it to do all the marketing for you. At the end of the day, you are the one that still needs to put in the work. You are the one that still needs to learn to be the marketer, not just another affiliate. Don't let this be an excuse for you not to develop the skill sets, to not be there for the people who are tuning into your content. And then you just leave them in the dust. You got to put in the work and just understand that if you're going to use AI as part of your marketing strategy, you can do so, but don't let it take over your whole business entirely. Okay, so let me go ahead and go back, stop sharing my screen. And I didn't have any questions that came in prior to this live stream episode, but I'll be around here for another few minutes if you've got any questions. I'm going to go ahead and take a quick sip of water, and then I'll check for any questions that may come about. Otherwise, if there are no questions, I'll go ahead and wrap this up. Okay, I don't see any more questions coming in. I trust you got a ton of value out of this live stream episode. And if you did, I invite you to join me on the journey of achieving time freedom through affiliate marketing. I've got an exclusive Independence Day promotion going on right now at the time of this video. And I highly encourage you to check it out if you've been struggling with affiliate marketing or looking to expand your income by looking for the link below this video. Check out the full details in the post that I've created for this promotion. And if you have any questions or anything that you need help on, I'm here to help you every step of the way. If you've been struggling with affiliate marketing, you've been spending hours upon hours of research only to be more overwhelmed, more confused, or if you've gotten ripped off in the past, I'm here to help guide you and offer you an exclusive advantage to getting started with your business so that you can become profitable with it over the long term. Okay, so with that said, this is Mark Castillo, aka the Digital Marketing Warrior. Thank you so much for joining me in on this live stream episode. Have an amazing day, wherever you may be, whatever time zone that you're watching this from, and I'll see you on the next one very soon. 
Don't forget to check out that exclusive Independence Day promotion I got going on. And with that said, take care and all the absolute best.